Oh, I have to do this slow. Okay. Everybody, welcome back to another video. Today's video is about COV ID 19, the novel coronavirus, um, and its effect on your dog. So as everybody pretty much knows at this point that has access to the internet or any kind of online publication or social website, there is a virus going around that's affecting the entire world um, known as COVID or Rona or the coronavirus or the novel uh, coronavirus. And I've also been seeing a lot of pictures of people um, posting their dogs on social media, wearing masks and wondering if the coronavirus will actually affect their pets. So I'm going to try my best to break down what information I've been able to gather down to help you guys the best that I can. Can dogs contract or spread coronavirus COVID-19? Dogs can contract certain types of coronaviruses, such as the canine respiratory coronavirus, but this specific novel coronavirus, aka COVID-19, is believed to not be a threat to dogs. Canine coronavirus, CCOV, is not the same virus as SARS-CoV-2 that causes the novel coronavirus, COVID-19. CCOV does not affect people. CCOV causes gastrointestinal problems in dogs as opposed to a respiratory disease. Canine corona vaccines are available. This vaccine is not recommended for all dogs and will be administered based on your dog's lifestyle and risk assessment. The vaccines will only work for the CCOV type of coronavirus. It is not effective for the prevention of COVID-19. So what does that mean for you and your dog? Basically is that your dog is protected against you and you are protected against your dog. But that does not mean that you don't need to still wash your hands and sanitize and clean very well because it can um, the virus that the humans catch does live on surfaces for a few days. So make sure that you're using um, hand sanitizer, make sure that you're washing out your dog's dish, make sure you're washing your hands before you feed your dog, um, before you give them snacks and treats and things out of your hand. Um, it's just very important because, you know, other people touch your dog and you've been touching your dog and we just don't really know too much about the the virus and how exactly um, bad it's going to get. So we want to protect ourselves and protect the people that we care about the best that we can. And the way that we do that is by sanitizing and washing. So all this information and more can be found on the CDC's website. They actually have a full article specifically about um, COVID-19 and canines. So. I suggest looking at that. I'll leave the link to that article in the description box. And also I'll leave a link to the article that CNN posted about um, canines and COVID-19. Until next time, peace. I'm out.